Welcome back to Universal Corey Day. My name is Corey Day. Today's video, we are hitting the streets of London to find out which country is people's favourites and why. Let's go. Janelle. Janelle. Odette. Odette. Nice to meet you both. But where are you from? New York. But Dominican. Yeah, I'm Dominican. New York, but Dominican. Uh, oh, okay, cool. Yeah. At least you know each other. We're cousins. Question today is, what is your favourite country and why? Dominican Republic because we got the best food. Nice. We got the best music. Okay. And just best everything. The best dances, everything. Okay. Same. 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 Okay. Describe the Dominican public in one word. Amazing. Amazing. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. What's a slang or phrase that you really like in the Dominican Republic language? I guess it's Spanish, right? Que lo que? Que lo que? Yeah, que lo que. It's like, what's up? Comiendo boca. <laughs> Comiendo boca. Boca. What does that mean? Like minding, um, not minding your business. Not minding your business. Yeah. So how would you use that? It's like, if I'm paying attention to other people, yeah. I'll be like, I'm comiendo boca. Uh, you're, you're not minding your business. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. You're being other people's business. Yeah. Oh, Okay, okay, one more time. Comiendo boca. Comiendo boca, okay. I feel like that's what I'm doing right now, being in love with people's business with these questions. All right, so from the Dominican Republic, because I'm not that familiar, who is a famous person or public figure that you really like? Romeo Santos. He's like a Dominican bachata singer. Oh, yeah. Oh, do you do bachata? Yeah. Can you show me some moves? <laughs> Come on, ladies. Yeah. Where's the music at? I need the music. You need music? Okay. Music. We'll leave bachata for another time. Okay, and yourself? Anthony Santos, because he also sings bachata and I love his music. Okay. Yeah. You make me want to go to the Dominican Republic to do bachata. I bachata in the Dominican Republic sounds like a vibe. What's your favorite food or dish from the Dominican Republic? Notre Golpes, which is like mango, salami, and queso. Sancocho. It's like a soup and it has different kind of meat. Mm -hmm. And there's just corn. I love it. And then if there was one thing you could bring from the Dominican Republic to wherever you were, what would it be? It's definitely the mango, what I just said. Also the, the country club soda. Oh. It's really good, yeah. From Buesa, that's the best flavor. Okay. I made that. Our music. You're selling the Dominican Republic to be honest, Liz. What's one interesting fact about the Dominican Republic that you think people don't know and they should? That we made a yeah. bachata. The Dominican Republic made a bachata? Yeah, I, yeah. Think so. yeah. Right. I will fact check. If they're wrong, I'm going to do a good book. I mean, I think it's the facts here, so let me tell <laughs> <laughs> And our flag is the only flag with the Bible verse in it. Wow. Yeah. What is the Bible verse? Do you know? Uh, gotcha. Do you have any message that you'd want to share to the world? Yeah, visit Dominican Republic. We're the best. We have the best food, the best everything. A lot of like, okay, we bought the Republic Dominicana. Okay, nice. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Ona mai wa? Mid. Kana desu. Konnichimasu. Ichiban suki na kuni wa doko desu ka? Korea desu. Pari desu. Doshite ano Korea ichiban suki na kuni desu ka? Food mo oishi. K-pop. K-pop. Hai. Ichiban suki na kankoku ryori wa? Bibimba. Bibimba ba ha daisuki desu. Sugoi oishi. Utsumi ga kirei desu ne. Keshiki to ka. Hitokoto de kankoku to pari setsume shite kudasai. Kawaii. Kawaii. Eh, oi ne, oi ne. おしゃれ。おしゃれ。そうですね。結構おしゃれですね。一番好きな方、あのセレブティとかは誰ですか？ケーポップアイドルのアイブ。アイブ。はい。どうしてですか？ハワイ。ハワイ。遅い。うん。
yeah, 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 yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Yo, Australia is wild out here. We do not use <laughs> just lightly like that. That is. We said that yesterday when we came. We're like, yeah, yo, someone's gonna punch you in the <laughs> face, man. In the UK, we do not use like unless you're your friends with the person, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Who is your favorite celebrity or public figure from Australia? Yeah, Bailey Smith. <laughs> Likes footy. What AFL, yeah. Okay, okay. yeah. So anyone else is having Bailey Smith? I'm a big Volkanovski guy. The UFC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, it's cool. Josh Giddy. Josh Giddy. <laughs> In one word, how would you describe Australia? Livable. Very livable. Okay. Yeah. Hot. I'd say relaxed. Everyone's like relaxed, yeah. calm, go to the beach, have a few beers. But you guys are selling Australia, I'm telling you. All right, cool. What's one interesting fact about Australia that you think the world should know? We have the best beaches in the world. What's the number one for you that you think? I got a beach shack at a place called Buff Beach in Australia, okay. in, in Adelaide. Yeah. And it's awesome. awesome. No one goes there. It's really chill. Like We might go now. Okay. Yeah, well, I hope not. Yeah. Okay. We'll do it footy again. Like You guys are football, man. Right. Yeah. I thought we were obsessed with sports in this country. Right, like We got like, what, small population, but the average like 70,000 people to a footy game and a stadium. 70K? Wow, you guys love your sports. I guess it's like sunshine and sports, not much else to do. Sunshine and not, not, not get killed by animals, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's, that animal stuff is doo-doo, like, that's not, yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. real, it's, it's not. Someone, someone said that, we didn't interview somebody else, did they say that? Only in the outback, not in the main city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the city, I swear, it's like this. Like. You guys have been amazing, man. Thank you, thank you, peace. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, Sorry. nice, nice. Okay, I'm here with... Village. Where are you from? Turkey. What is your favorite country in the world and why? I guess now it's London. How's... It's very aesthetic. I guess we're in a very aesthetic part of London at the moment. What in particular is aesthetic about it for you? What makes it aesthetic? This. Yes, the Big Bang. Big okay. Bang. If you could describe London or the UK in one word, what would it be? Bargain. Bargain? <laughs> yeah. Bargain? Okay. What's bargain about London? You think it's a good prices? It's a fast food restaurant. Oh. Uh, so bargains and fast food, that's the one word that comes to mind. Oh, that's good. Yeah, we do love a bargain in the UK. Yeah. <laughs> so bargain is like buy one, get one free. And who is your favorite celebrity or famous person from the UK? Harry Styles. Why, why Harry Styles? He's like good singer and handsome. So you're from Turkey. Yeah. So I take it you speak Turkish. Yeah. What's a slang, phrase or word that is really good for people to know from the Turkish language? Aynan. Aynan. Yeah. What does it mean? Yeah. The same thing. Same. As in you think the same thing? Yeah. So if somebody says something and you think the same thing, you can say Aynan. Yeah. Uh, okay. Thank you for teaching me some Turkish. Thank you for taking part of today's... Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with... I'm Anthony. Anthony and... Ada. What is your favorite country and why? I would say it will have to be the United States. Outside of the US, probably... Estonia. Estonia. Colin. Nice. Estonia. Colin was amazing. I loved it. I love yeah. that. Probably Vietnam. Vietnam. Okay. So let's start with Estonia, Tallinn. What is it that you liked about Tallinn that makes it your favorite? Scuba diving. Scuba diving? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Cool. Scuba diving out of the quarry in Rium Ruma. Okay. I, I forget the name, but okay. it was an underwater prison. It's very cool. Underwater prison? Yeah. Wow. Any recommendations or advice for somebody who's interested in scuba diving? As somebody who's done that a couple of times? Just go for it. Okay. And Vietnam. What's your favorite place? I like the coffee. The coffee tastes really good. Yeah, like yeah. literally everywhere you just go, any store, coffee is amazing. Might be strong for some people though. Sound like you're a coffee connoisseur, so probably not too strong for you. I like sweet. Like, <laughs> like sweet? Yeah, I like sweet coffee. Like sweet coffee? Yes. But is the coffee bitter? So you've got yeah. some sugar in it? Yeah, I can't drink black one. Oh, I, okay. I just like put a lot of creamer and sugar oh, in there. Interesting, nice. Yeah. Alright, how would you describe Vietnam in one word? It's cheap, yes. <laughs> Are you? It's how would you cheap. describe Estonia in one word? Very clean. Amazingly clean. It was interesting. I uh, couldn't find trash anywhere. <laughs> Vietnam is not clean, she says. Vietnam yeah. is not clean. No. Alright. Share one word or phrase from your favorite country. Uh, incroyable. Incroyable? Yeah. What does that mean? Uh, so, I think yeah, I think so. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Amazing. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> What's one interesting fact about Vietnam that you'd like to share with the world? You can just see kids and just like don't really just hang out outside and then they just like smoking and stuff. Kids smoking? Yeah. Oh, okay. And this is, it's really dirty and but I mean the people are nice and then the food are del delicious but if you stomachs are not strong I wouldn't really recommend street food yeah. from Viet yeah. Vietnam. Yeah. Everything fun and all that stuff yeah. is really good. Awesome. Very safe country. Yeah. One of the safest. Considering it's bordering Russia, it's, a, it's okay. surprisingly safe. Do you have a favorite food or dish from Estonia? I have two. Bread bowls, Bread well, bowls. beef stew, and the moose meatballs. Ooh, sounds nice. Yeah. It's very good. Cool. Yeah. Bought, uh, me and coffee. Uh, 
Is there a particular type of food that you like? I usually only get the chicken broth one. Awesome, fantastic. Thank you so much. Alex. Alex, and where are you from? The States. Nice. Where in the States are you from? Originally Texas, but I live in New York City now. Nice. What's your favorite country and why? As of now, my favorite country is Ireland, the Republic of Ireland. Nice. Yeah. Which part did you go to and what was favorite about it? I've been to Dublin and then the West Coast, and my favorite's the West Coast. It's just really gorgeous. Yeah. The Cliffs of Moher, yeah. New Orleans, adorable, Galway. Yeah, really fun. It's a beautiful country. And how did you find the people treated you when you were there? Oh my gosh, amazing. It's actually part of the reason why Ireland's my favorite country. I saw on a Google thing that it was ranked the number one safest country for women to solo travel to. And that might be outdated, but I felt really safe. And as a black American, felt like really welcomed. And I think because of the history of oppression in Ireland, there's just a lot of solidarity. And I really loved it. Like it felt like home. Yeah. That's yeah. amazing. That's amazing. Yeah. Did you go out late at night? And if so, what did you go and do? Yeah, in Dublin, I went to a couple pubs but nothing crazy okay. yeah <laughs> what pub would you recommend in dublin haven't been there i mean it's cheesy but temple bar was really fun to go just one time for like the aesthetic yeah temple bar it's this really famous bar you can get an overpriced guinness but it's really pretty and you can take your pictures did you learn any slang from ireland and if so can you share in your phrases yeah. that your favorite ones are or i only remember how to say cheers which is slan in gaelic yeah uh -huh. like, yeah i live in the uk and i never knew that slan yeah yeah. Well, we're back. Sloan. Yeah. Sloan. Yeah. Cool. Thank you so much. Thank Have a good day. Yeah. I'm Mario. Mario. Okay. Yes. Tuomo. Tuomo? Yes. Hanna. Hanna? Yeah. Johan. Johan. Yeah. Very different names I've never met before. Where, where are you all from? Finland. Finland. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. From the same area in Finland or different areas? Uh, Tampere. What's your favorite country in the world and why? I think, yes, Tampere, Finland, because <laughs> there is everything you need and it's clean. Vasa. Clean, Finland, yes. What, what's unique about Vasa? Vasa. Vasa? Best place in the world. Okay, why? No, it's nice. Okay. <laughs> and you, your favorite place? Finland, yeah, yeah, yeah. because it's my home country. Okay. Yeah, Finland also, because I like the difference in like the weather when we have the cold winter and then we have the very well summer. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to, I don't want to quote, but you can have it. Yeah, yeah. What's something about Finland or whichever places you talked about that you think is interesting but the world does not know? Maybe in the south, northern parts of Finland, the northern lights are really nice and also the, like there's so much snow and cold. That's a, like minus 30 degrees. That's something like you have to like experience once a lifetime. Also, the thing about Finland is like uh, you can experience so much di different like in Helsinki it's like really nice city and when you go to the northern part it's nothing. No, no people there. No people there. Yeah, so that's the difference, the main part, yeah, I like that. Pyynikin munkkikahvila from Tampere. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Say that? <laughs> Coffee place in our home city, Tampere. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, very, very delicious. I think also Pyynikin munkkikahvila, because it's very beautiful place. Nice. Tampere also is very beautiful yeah. place. Finnish people are very, like... <laughs> but we like to keep uh, quiet and ourselves. Yep. But also we like people. If you see a celebrity, we are not, oh, okay. but no, okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, talking about celebrity, who is your favorite celebrity or public figure from your areas? Ville Valo. Ville Valo? Ville Valo. Who's that? Singer from him. Okay. Nice. Okay. I say same. Ville Valo. Okay. Well, I have to say Kimi Räikkönen, the right. Formula One driver. Yeah, because he's like the, like every, every other Finnish guy. Yeah. yeah. Has, he, has he ever won yeah. F1 championship? Yeah, once, once. once. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, the last guy who won at February 2007. Yeah. Right. Fantastic. Describe Finland or your various areas in one word. Uh, quiet. Peaceful. Amazing. Amazing. I love it. <laughs> Fabulous. Fabulous. <laughs> they are really selling Finland to the world. And what is... A Finnish slang that's useful to know, that's interesting as well. Pergele, like Satan. <laughs> when is that used in a sentence? Like every time. Pergele tää on kuuma, like f**k it's hot. Pergele tää on kylmä, f**k it's cold. Pergele. 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 Yes, it's just where you Pergele. Pergele. Pergele, okay. And you? Pöyre. Pöyre. I swear, Finnish is the hardest language ever. Pergele, say again. Pöyre. What does it mean? You yeah. in a sentence, you in a sentence. Tuo on aivan pöyre. Like, that guy's crazy. Tuo on aivan pöyre. I say kiitos. Thank you. Right. Yeah. Kiitos. Kiitos. It means thank you. Yeah. Kiitos. I should remember that one. I'll say that to you then. Yeah. Are you? Ha! <laughs> is that a word or just like a sound? Ha! What is that? It's like, ha! 
What? Thank what? what? Yes. <laughs> Kitos to all of you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. David. David, and where are you from? Colombia. Colombia. Nice to meet you. What is your favorite country? My favorite country right now is United Kingdom. Country I travel international. Okay. And I really excited. There's so much to see, there's much to explore. So this is your first country? Yeah. Like you've left outside of Colombia? Yeah. So you, you didn't even go to any neighboring countries in South America? No. The UK? Colombia and the UK. Wow. Okay, okay. Are you going to stay one month? One month? Okay, what will you be doing for the one month? Uh, study English in one month. Okay. Your English is already really good, so... <laughs> How did you learn English so well? Independent? Independent? Oh, don't yeah. Two months, more or less. So you don't have anyone you speak English with in Colombia? No. No? Only me. Can you see this world? You can learn English by yourself. This is crazy. I'm sorry. I feel like you're lying to me. You must have been talking to some people in English. Really? Yeah. Wow. That's amazing. In the plane, I talk with some people who were born here in near Liverpool. Yeah. And it's what the first time I speak to someone to don't understand Spanish. Okay. And was really exciting. Wow. How did you find that? Because Liverpool, they have a very strong accent. Were you able to communicate? Yeah, I understand him. Okay. As somebody who's learned English by themselves effectively, what tip would you give to people to learn English quickly as you have? Listen. Listening. Listening to music, podcasts, videos. It's really helpful to understand a lot of people. See, that's what I say as well. You've got to just be listening and taking in lots of information and then you just absorb it like that. What's a slang word from the UK that you really like? Water. 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 <laughs> water. Water, water is... Yeah. So the US would be like water, but here it's water. water. Yeah, water. 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 I know that one goes down well with people. How would you describe the UK in one word? Amazing. Amazing. Can you hear that? Amazing UK. We're doing well. We're not doing too badly. All right. What's something that is interesting about the UK that people don't know? Infrastructure. Infrastructure? Yeah. Which part? Big Ben, the bridge, yeah. the palace, or head like that. What do you like about them? The age of the, the building. Yeah, the yeah, yeah. They're very old. They're, yeah. like, they're big. Okay, cool. What's one thing you'd like to take from the UK back to Colombia? T-shirts. T-shirts? Yeah. Wait, which, which kind of T-shirts? Oh, I'm very fan of Harry Potter, so I, <laughs> I like to... Harry Potter, Potter. okay. So you should go to Harry Potter world. You know, like the Harry Potter world. Yeah. You should go there. In Colombian, Colombian Spanish, what's a phrase or word that you really like and you think people should know? No de papaya. One more time. No. No. De. De. Papaya. No de papaya. Yeah. What does that mean? So, so you have your family like that. Yeah. So in Colombia, it's... Oh, they'll steal uh, your phone. Yeah. They'll steal your phone. It means no de papaya. It yeah. means they'll steal your phone. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I don't want my phone stolen, so no, no, no de papaya. The opposite of no de papaya. I keep my phone. What's the best thing that you've experienced in the UK so far? Aside from meeting me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, train. Train? Yeah. 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 It's the first time I see a train. Really? You haven't gone on a train in Colombia? No. no? Nothing. There got to be trains in Colombia. You make Colombia sound like it's... No? That is not active. Where are you from in Colombia? Cali, Colombia. Cali, Colombia. Okay. Trains. Can you imagine? Trains. Well, you, no wonder you like Harry Potter because it's all about trains to an extent. Every year they get on a train. All right. Fantastic. Thank you. Have a good one. Take care. All right. I'm here with... Your name? Collins. It's nice to meet you. Where are you from, Collins? I'm from Nigeria. What is your favorite country in the world and why? Italy. Italy. Okay. They have a nice culture, nice food, nice environment. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What's your favorite place that you like in Italy? Oh, I would say you come to Tuscany. Yeah. What's in Tuscany? That's amazing. Nice beach. Yeah. Yeah. Very beautiful. Okay. Good food. Good people. What's something about Italy or Tuscany that the world doesn't know that you think they should know or you'd like to share? Uh, what I think about Tuscany, you know, the culture, they have a good culture. They are good uh, people, good manners, you know, the way they approach to you, they are manners, nice rivers. You know, we are to chill out, they have nice uh, clubs, they, they have good securities. Okay. And how would you describe Tuscany or Italy in one word? Beautiful place. Beautiful. Okay, beautiful. What's a slang or phrase from Tuscany or Italy that you really like and you think is interesting to share with the world? Bello. Bello. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's that uh, beautiful, good place. It's yeah. that, uh, if you could bring one thing from Italy or Tuscany to any country that you were going to, what would it be? Pizza. Pizza. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Very typical but understandable. Also, wine. Wine. Red okay. wine. They have also good red wines okay. over there too. Thank you, Collins. I appreciate it. Take care. Peace. I'm here with... Milike. Nice to meet you. Where are you from? Turkey. 
What is your favorite country and why? It's cool with Turkey right? because I'm from Turkey. <laughs> so you're the third person who said Turkey today and I think two of them were not from Turkey. So why is Turkey your favorite country? Because unfortunately I couldn't go there more than seven years okay. uh, because of the some problems. So I really missing my country. So I hope one day I could be visit in there again. Okay. What is it that you love about Turkey? Aside from it being your the weather. The weather? <laughs> yeah. Yeah? Well, doesn't it get cold sometimes? Or you like the cold? You don't mind the cold? Unfortunately, in the Newcastle, it's so cold and so windy yeah. and always the rainy. <laughs> yeah. So I'm a, like a, a easily cold. Yeah. That's why I don't like. Yeah, I Fair enough. And your favorite celebrity? Uh, Arda Turan. He's a famous football. Okay. Yeah, and what is a slang? from in Turkish that you think the world should know that's useful to know a slang word in the Turkish language Her şey yolunda Her şey, what does that mean? Her şey yolunda everything is all on the way Her şey yolunda Since you've jumped into the interview what's your name? My name is Omer Where are you from? Uh, Turkey Alright so the question was what's your your favourite country in the world? I'm guessing is it Turkey? Of course Turkey I'm <laughs> from Turkey okay. Why is Turkey your favourite country in the world? Uh, especially in Istanbul I love Istanbul most because this is the historical places and the natural places Natural yeah. places Alright If you could describe Turkey in one word what would it be? Good weather Good weather Yeah Friendly Friendly? Yeah very friendly okay. Yeah. Good <laughs> <laughs> What's one interesting fact about Turkey that you'd like the world to know that the world doesn't know? There are many touristical places and uh, they have to discover, I think. Okay, which one would you recommend that people don't usually go to a tourist place? Moscow. Okay. Maybe they have to go with okay. and visit. The natural places, like for example Galata Tover, okay. also it's very special in Turkey. Okay. As a Muslim, what non-Muslim country to you is the most welcoming for Muslims and why? Without doubt, in the UK. UK? Yeah, really. Okay. Because when I come to here, are you from UK? Yeah, I'm from Really, UK. when I come to here the first time, I see many people is different. For example, like a hijab, like a opening the orders, all countries, all religions I'll see there. So all are all together, but nobody disturbs each other. So this is very nice things for me. And when I ask the people why you like that, they said they never disturb you because they're all going to their own way. Okay. So even I see the here mosque, okay. I see all the church, yeah. the, all the things. Remind me like Ottoman Empire time. Okay. All religions come together, okay. nobody disturb each other. Okay. Yeah. Really, that's why I like it in uh, UK. Yeah. I asked the people, the Muslim people also say, yeah. this is the best place for Muslim in the Europe or in yeah, the... Uh, yeah, really. And you? I'm agree. You agree? UK. UK. Okay. And you? Young yeah, yeah, yeah. Young. All right. So look at that, London. We're we the UK. We're not doing too badly in terms of supporting Muslim people, but we should still be tolerant of other people and races and religions. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.